Hey, what's up YouTube? In this problem, I'm going to show you how to solve a very simple partial differential equation. So in this problem, u here is a function of two variables. Uh, so u can actually be written as u of x comma y, kind of like you would see uh, in a calculus 3 class. So it's a multi-variable uh, function. So u sub x, um, this denotes the first partial derivative of u with respect to x. So it's the rate of change of u uh, in the x direction. So it's del u del x. And then u x x, well, this is simply the second partial derivative of u with respect to x. OK, so to solve this equation, in other words, we have to find all functions u that satisfy this. So before we do it, let me just recall something um, from other math. If you're integrating with, if you have a function of two variables, say you have, um, let's say you have x, y and you're integrating with respect to x, okay, just with respect to x. What you do um, is you treat the y as constant, okay? So there's a one here, you would use the power rule, so you would get x squared over two, y, and then you would add an unknown function of the other variables. So when we integrate with respect to x, we add, say, uh, unknown function of y. And the reason is, uh, when you differentiate this piece with respect to x, uh, the derivative of this piece here, g of y, is actually zero, right? Because um, you treat everything else as constant. So if you go backwards, if you take the derivative of this with respect to x, um, the derivative of g of y is zero. So instead of just adding a plus c, we have to add uh, an unknown function of the other variable. Okay, now that that's out of the way, um, this problem is actually very, very simple. So we start this problem by integrating both sides with respect to x. So integrate with respect to x, okay? So we're basically integrating away one of the derivatives, so we end up with u sub x. And when we integrate zero, we get a constant, but again, um, knowing what we just talked about, you add an unknown function of the other variables. So we're integrating with respect to x, so we add an unknown function of y. So that's equal to f of y. Then you integrate again, so integrate, integrate with respect to x, and then you integrate away the derivative, so you just get u. I'll, I'll be fancy, I'll call it u of x, y. And then this is a constant, right? It's, it's a function of y, it's a, um, so we're holding it constant when we integrate with respect to x. So it's f of y times x, right? Like if it was 2, it would be 2x. If it was 3, it would be 3x. It's f of y, which we're holding constant, so it's f of y times x, plus an unknown function of the other variable which we'll call g of y. So this would be um, the solution to the partial differential equation. So I really hope this video uh, made sense. And if it didn't make sense, you know, leave uh, questions and stuff in the comments. Um, I hope that helped.